Johnny Lanthorn uh, from the town of Lee, North Carolina. We're here doing our final inspection on the special property. Uh, President of the board of the town of Lee uh, Fire Department, as well as a lieutenant in the Fire Department. One unique thing we did with this truck, uh, it's going to be outfitted with the hydraulics as well as standard hydraulics. And in this front bumper, we're going to have the hydraulics stored in the center of the station, as well as a jump line. Help us accidents on 95 or anything else. With well, this truck here, it's equipped with the EMAC system. It's a new iron part, and we chose to go with the EMAC to do it being a smaller footprint on the truck, which is going to give us an added space to add, carry more equipment on this truck. And this truck here is actually going to replace three at the station that we have now, uh, so we'll be able to go up on the scene with one truck. In addition to us using the hydraulics off the front bumper in the back here, we're going to use the standard uh, hydraulics. We'll have two reels set up here. The tools will be in this tray, and a pump. The hydraulic pump will be in a compartment on the uh, officer side. On the back of the truck, we're going to have a thousand feet of five-inch LDH. Also with uh, two two and a half inch pre-connects as well off the back of this truck. So it's going to actually it is a uh, a rescue pumper. One cool thing we've done on this truck is a section on it where we can organize our ribbon. Uh, it'll be stored in an organized fashion to be able to deploy it very quickly on a on a scene. Uh, we won't have to worry about trying to dig down fighting to get the ribbon out of it. It'd be real easy to just pull off the truck and access the scene. Work worked with a couple of great guys, uh, Fire Connections, uh, Travis Mayo, Grant Vick, along with the team at E1 to make this truck a reality. It was beyond our expectations. Uh, we took it out on a test drive today and honestly this thing drives as good as any car. It is smooth, uh, it looks awesome, Something this big, it's just amazing to me how, how well it handles. It turns, just rides really great. E1 makes a great product. This is our third one. We have a 93, a 2013 model, and now with this 2021 model, we uh, hope to continue our relationship with E1 for a long time.